So Captain Falcon is a character, of course, appearing in Smash Brothers. Um, he does all the Falcon attacks and what game is he even from? Oh, he's from F Zero. What's we gotta know who this guy is. Captain Falcon was introduced into Smash Brothers as a playable character. Outside of that, he has only been cows and F Zero. So he only had his only his face has ever been seen outside of, of course, Smash Brothers. So Captain Falcon is the main character, the F Zero, and as a member of the Perfect Attendance Group. Captain Falcon has been playable for the entirety of Smash Bros. series. A Smash Bros. without Captain Falcon is basically like taking um taking Smash Bros. away and just crumbling it up and throwing it into the garbage. So, and that's basically it. Um, F Zero is a lesser known franchise. Captain Falcon is still considered a fan favorite because he's just so cool. Everybody loves him. Captain Falcon was meant to be the flagship character to end Super SNES, but F Zero was released, and he was the first character designed of Captain Falcon. And three other F Zero characters appeared. Um, Captain Falcon, blah blah blah. He appeared in other F Zero games until they start making F Zero games. He was also created as um. A character, Smash Bros. was originally intended to be with no Nintendo characters. So, Captain Falcon says the same model with Dragon King the fighting game before Nintendo characters were added. Also, Captain Falcon carries a gun, but he never uses it. And of course, Captain Falcon is now the most meme character in Smash Bros. Captain Falcon is the only character to get OJA from a racing game. <laughs> so, who is Captain Falcon? Captain Falcon is a accomplished F-Zero pilot, a renowned, talented bounty hunter, and eccentric man in his 30s. He is a resident of Earth Hailing from the city of Port Town. His bounty hunting has yielded him enough of a reputation that he has gained many enemies across the galaxy, including Black Shadow. He runs away and he dances to our pearl go just to get money. So, basically, Captain Falcon raises just for the money. So, and of course, it goes over how he was a playable character in Smash Brothers and every. Smash Bros. game. Also, in the first Smash Bros., he's the one of the few characters that not have a state at all. Probably because they wanted to make him a secret character, but. Oh, yeah, also, Captain Falcon's 46 years old, according to. F Zero X or GX games I never even played before. <coughs> and it's only forties, he's forty six coin two. And F Zero X, um it was a Captain Falcon is a bounty hunter just like Samus. He has really reputation as well the best bounty hunters in the galaxy. I guess Samus will have to say something about that, but basically the same thing. So Captain Falcon just does whatever he wants. And, and they even made a Captain Falcon, they even made an F Zero anime. And the only other games he have ever appeared in was Smash Bros. So unless they make an actual F Zero game. And besides our Easter eggs and DLC for Mario Kart, I don't think we're gonna see Captain Falcon as a playable. I don't think we'll see it. Uh, and once we get our F Zero game, outside of Smash Bros. and possibly Mario Kart, 
Captain Falcon will probably never be um in another game again. So this is the story of Captain Falcon. There isn't much to talk about Captain Falcon, as he is just a guy who races and does bounty hunting for a living. And this is how he has changed over the years. Goodbye. Oh yeah, and also make sure you like, subscribe and turn on the stupid bell because we all know everybody hates it, but that's basically how we have to do it now.